During the pandemic, people have found all sorts of different ways to get through their days, right? A lot of people discovered a joy of walking or bike riding that they didn't know they had. And this was certainly a surprise for me. I had no idea I was going to become addicted to painting my fence. We're here in the, the Hollywood district of Portland, and this is the Hope Fence. The Hope Fence evolved over the last 10 months. I found myself a couple of days into the lockdown in Portland, feeling very disconnected from the world like we all were. I decided I was going to paint the words, we're all in this together, on the fence. A couple people stopped and said, like, oh, I love that, thank you. And I was like, oh, come, come join, do it with me, or, you know, or, or add your message. So I just decided that I would come back the next day and go outside and do it again. It really was a sort of therapy for me. And then people started adding messages or asking me to add messages. And it really did become kind of a community journal. We've been walking by the fence for months now on our daily outing. And it keeps evolving and it keeps developing and growing into this beacon for our neighborhood and for our city and maybe for our world. Our neighborhood has used the Hope Fence as a safe way to gather outside some candlelight ceremonies during the protests during the summer. A costume parade where you walk by and get to present your, your costume. One of my favorite moments was coming around the corner. There was a nurse practitioner who was wearing full scrubs and she was standing on her hands. So I took her picture and then I painted that story. So I'm in chemo right now. I've been, yeah, just relapsed. And, and so this just was a very um, special connection. Every time I drive by, I, I look. I literally come here every time I go to the hospital. So. I make time to come out here every day to add something. Sometimes I just paint over the top of something that's fading. It very much feels like it is inviting and creating a space to share. Sometimes I come out and there's something on the fence that I didn't add and that makes me so happy. <laughs> and it really did become kind of a community journal.